week's clothes and today I have a collective beauty haul for you guys and I'm just going to get straight on with the video because I have a lot of stuff and when I mean a lot of stuff I mean a lot of stuff and in no way am I trying to brag this has been collecting up since my last beauty haul which I think was in February and yeah let's just get into it so I'm going to start off with the stuff that um, I didn't actually buy myself and I got sent and the first place that wanted to send me some things were Sigma and I'm just gonna get in so they sent me four brushes I'm not gonna like dwell on items in this video otherwise this video will end up being 20 minutes and I do not have the Wi-Fi speed to upload a 20 minute video but they sent me this one which is the blending E25 for eyeshadow and as you can see it's been used they sent me another eyeshadow one and this is just the eye shading E55 this one which is the 3d HD precision so it's like good for like under the eyes concealer but I wasn't a massive fan of this one and finally the 3D HD Kabuki brush which is really dense and soft and it's great for foundation which I used it for and yeah those are the brushes they sent me they then sent me uh, a few actual makeup products the first thing they sent me were these samples of blush highlights and contours so they got me Mellow, Peaceful, Born to Incern I think Born to Incern are the most blush colours Peaceful is a highlighter and Mellow is a contour. I'm not going to do close-ups of all these, but if I think an item deserves a close-up because you can't really see it properly, then I will. The next product they sent me was this single full-size eyeshadow in the shade Fawn. And it's just this really nice pretty colour. I love the packaging, it's like holographic. But yeah, it's this really nice neutral, taupey, uh, like kind of like shimmery colour. And if I just swatch it, you probably can't see that but yeah I do genuinely really like this it's, this is like really me the next thing they sent me is this lip vex deluxe sample in the shade of Sheila and it's just this really nice pink glittery color they then sent me this inner rim brightener in the shade final touch and I've looked at this before and it's just like an eyeliner and um I think this would this is be good for like in the corners which I think is for and also you could use it as like a um eyeliner as well I think which would actually look quite cool and the final thing they sent me is this lip concealer I was so confused when I first got this I was like what the heck is a lip concealer but it's what you put on your lips before if you like have a darker or bright uh, colour and um, you want it to actually show up as it is in the packaging and I thought that was actually like such a good idea and yeah I've used a bit of it and this is in the shade Lose the Halo thank you so much Sigma if you want any of these products I will leave the Sigma link down below next on to the balm and the balm sent me a few things and when they contacted me you guys know that the balm is my favourite company I kind of freaked out a bit and I was like the fuck me is this a real life so yeah they actually wanted to send me some things and they let me pick out what i wanted on the website and the first thing i picked out was this balm shelter tinted moisturizer which is just a tinted moisturizer and you get a lot of products so this would be really good for like school if you don't want to um have a t morgan Shut up! The next thing they sent me is something you didn't actually ask for, but still. Uh, the Mr. Right Now eyeliner pencil in the shade Dean B Onyx. I don't know if I'm pronouncing that right, but it's just a black shade. And I'm trying to get it out, and it's not coming out. And I dropped it. And it like comes in like a crayon, and I think that's really cool. The next thing they sent me was the Brow Prow eyebrow powder in the shade I think medium, and I literally love this so much. And yeah, they then sent me the Bahama Mama bronzer, and the packaging is just so nice. And yeah, it's just a bronzer, and it's just a matte bronzer. And oh my god, I really want to get into bronzing and contouring because I am really pale, so it's really hard for me to do it. But yeah, I put I asked for this try and help me along with that. They then got me the Cheetah Mascara. I literally love the balm packaging and the wand on this is just so nice and it's like feels really thick and yeah. And they sent me two more things. The last, which are my two favourite things. They got me the Balm Girls lipstick in the shade May Bill's Bead. P B8, I don't know if I'm pronouncing that right, but it's just this really nice um, nude colour which is like a bit lighter than my actual lip colour and I'm literally in love with this. The final thing they got me, which is my favourite thing, is the Frat Boy Blush. Holy mama! Sita chica tica, bra, bra, bra. This is my favourite blush. Is this is really nice pinky colour and it just gives you a really nice natural flush. 
So me and Anastasia, as in Floral Princess here on YouTube, I'm sure you guys all know her, we decided to do a swap box and we didn't have a set amount of items or like a set price, we just got each other what we thought we would want. But yeah, we just decided to send each other um, some stuff and if you want to see what I got her, I'll leave her channel linked in the description box down below. I'm just going to whiz through all these things because otherwise this haul is going to be too long. She got me the MAC Hot and Naughty La uh, Lash Mascara and look how cool this packaging is. The Smashbox Highlighter Quad which comes with a cream blush and bronzer and a silvery highlighter and a uh, more white highlighter. The Milani Brow Fix Brow Kit and I love this so much. MAC Eye Curl Crayon in black. A pocket bag in Rio Samba Sunset, which is my fav new favourite scent. The Benefit Bella Bamba Lip Gloss, which I love. The Milani Baked Gloss uh, bl Blush in 01 Dolce Pink, which is such a nice colour. The Benefit Dare Real Mascara, which is my new favourite mascara, and the wand on this is so good. The Maybelline Jelly, Go bl Jelly Glow Blush in the shade 01. I think it's like bright pink, hot pink, something like that. But yeah, I really like this. And finally, two sh eyeshadows, the Maybelline 24 Colour um, Tattoo in the shade Permanent Taupe and the NYX um, Tattoo in ES04 Taupe. Oh wait, two more things, the Yes2 Grapefruit uh, Facial Wipes and EOS Fresh Flowers Hand Cream, which I don't actually have on me. But yeah, that's everything Anastasia got me. Thank you so much, Anastasia. Literally, I was so happy when I received my parcel. And yeah, moving on to more high-end things. Um, I got three things from MAC, I got two things from the Cinderella collection, which I cried, I got these off Depop, and I think they are still selling some MAC Cinderella things in Depop, so you should go check that out. Also, I'm selling some makeup and some clothes over on Depop, uh, my Depop is just at looking for Lois and yeah. The first thing I got, which if you watched my favourite video you would know, is the MAC um, Cinderella Coupe de Chic Iridescent Powder, which is this really nice pink blush with glitter undertones and I just love the packaging so much. The other thing I got is the MAC Cinderella lipstick in the shade Free as a Butterfly and this is just a really nice nude colour. Um, I really really like this and the packaging is literally flawless. I then got one other thing from MAC and this is the Mineralized Skin Finish Natural Powder and the box is actually so cool and I got mine in the shade Light. But yeah, this is just a powder and yeah, I'm super excited to use this. I don't know what it's like because I just bought this today. The next high-end thing I got, I actually got for free and it is Benefit's Posy Balm. How did you get this for free, you may be asking. I managed to save up enough Boots Card points to get me this. And this is such a nice colour and I've been lusting over this for ages and I'm literally so happy I finally got it. And if you're contemplating whether to get a Boots Card, get it. You can get benefit things for free of Too Faced if your local boot sells Too Faced. The final high end thing I got is a YSL lipstick. I got mine in the shade 01 because I'm the best, the first, the best. I know I said I wouldn't dwell on things for too long, but this is just such a nice colour. The package is just so nice. And I cried when I got this. So thank you so much, Lord, for producing these. Thank you. The first thing I got was from Superdrug, and this is the I Divine Sleek Oh So Special Eyeshadow Palette, which I have on today. And this is literally so nice. I think it was seven pounds. Open it. The one thing I do find annoying is they don't actually give you the shades. They give you the shades on this thing. So if you want to keep, if you like want to know like what shades things are, you've got to keep this, which is quite annoying. I have the shades Organiza, which is just this like neutrally shimmery shade all over, and then the shade Glitz, which is like this deep purple colour in the crease and out corner. And I literally love this so much. And you're going to be seeing a lot of two What's this? Okay, this brush can go, I do not need it. But yeah, oh my god, you're gonna be seeing so many tutorials on this. The other thing I got from Superdrug is the Tanya Burr, Tanya Burr lip gloss in the shade Chic. And oh my god, it's such a nice, like, nudie colour. Uh, why am I holding it up to this? I'm wearing a red lipstick. Anyway, um, I love the smell of this and the taste is so nice. And yeah, finally I've got something from Tanya Burr. Moving on to boots, I got the... Real Technique Stippling Brush, which I use for my foundation and I really, really, really love. And if you're looking to buy this, definitely buy this because I was 
debating for a while and now I'm so happy I finally got it. I went to Boots twice and each time there was a three for two on all cosmetics, not just on one brand, on every single cosmetics and I was like, oh, go Boots. So the first time I went, what did I get the first time? First time I went, I got these three. I got the Rimmel Kate Moss Lipstick in the shade 101, which is this really gorgeous pink color which I wore in my last video, I think. And I am in love with this. I then got the new L'Oreal Infallible 24 Hour Matte Foundation in the shade was it 10 Porcelain because I'm a pale person. And yeah, oh my god, so many people. Well, this, I've heard so many people being like, oh, this is horrible, and so many people being like, this is amazing. So uh, yeah, I'm gonna try it out for myself. Some people even said this was the best drugstore foundation, so I don't know. Then I got my first product from Seventeen, I think, and it is the Va Va Boom Volume Mascara. I love the packaging of this so much, and yeah, the wand is so nice. I used it today, and honestly, I literally love this so much. And the second time I went, I got another Kat Moss lipstick, this time in the shade 16, which is like a bit of a nudier pink colour, and I really, really like this. I then got another 17 product because I was so impressed with this I wanted to pick another one up. And I got the Stay Time Up to 25 Hour Foundation in the shade Porcelain, again because I'm pale and I literally love the packaging of this. I only got these bits today so yeah. Then I got the Super Glory Solar Powder finally. Oh my god the box is literally so tattered. Shame on you boots for actually selling this. But yeah. Okay, the products are good because I know some people's breaks, but it's just this bronzer and oh my god, you're getting blind. It's just this bronzer and highlighter duo because as I said earlier in the video, I want to get more into contouring, so hopefully this can help me along. Finally, I'm finished. That is everything in this haul. If you enjoyed this haul, please give it a big thumbs up and I'm so sorry it was so long. I don't mean to brag, but <laughs> that's on like... I don't mean to brag, but I was bragging. No, I wasn't bragging. I didn't mean this in a bragging way. Thank you guys so much for watching, and I'll see you guys soon for a new video. Bye!